We are all looking for that magic potion that will help us stay young. And for some, it is found in human growth hormone, or HGH. Dr. Jenny Wilkins from Age Vital Pharmacy is here to help us understand if this really is the fountain of youth. Mm. All right, most of us know about HGH from the athletic scandals yeah, and right. people getting involved in it. What is human growth hormone? Well, human growth ho hormone, everybody goes through a period in their life where you, you know, when you're going through andropause or menopause, you actually go through something called somatopause. Oh. So somatotropin is an actual chemical in our body that's in there. You can measure it and test for it where your somatropin comes to a pause, which is human growth hormone. Human growth hormone, believe it or not, I tell people, don't be scared of it. It's just amino acids. And what are amino acids? Oh. The building blocks to everything. That starts to plummet. Everything else starts to plummet so in your body as well. So we have it in our bodies. You have it in our body. It it's just something, right? Goes the away. athletes, the ones that are over abusing, and that's what gives it a bad name because they think more is better, more is better. They feel so great when they're on it. They want to take more and more and more and more, and then okay. everything else starts to grow with it. It's a oh. it's a hormone that promotes growth in your body. So mm -hmm. growth from tissue to cartilage to more white blood cells. The more white blood cells you have, the better your immune system. I mean, the elderly need it. I wish I was like a billionaire oh. so I could go to nursing <laughs> homes. I, you I'll, know? I'll be 79 next week. Would it help me? Oh, absolutely. Really? Yeah, they use it. You see Suzanne Summers, how magnificent she looks. What is she, like 74, 75? And she's like her sexy years where she's wow. doing a growth hormone. Sy Sylvester Stallone, same thing, 76, 77 years old. You have doctors like Dr. Jeffrey Life. Look him up. You know, he's got six pack abs. All you right, know, well, let's take a look at some wow. of the symptoms what? for when we know that we're not yeah. having as much human growth hormone being produced as we want to. Well, people will often get anxious or they start feeling depressed. Guys will start going bald. And then you get mm -hmm. lots of low energy fatigue, low sex drive, um, and then dec decreased strength is the big one. You know, especially when mommies are having children right after you have that postpartum uh -huh. your growth hormones really low I remember with baby number four I couldn't even open up like a jar normally I'm like oh and I open up everything you know where other women can do it and I'm going oh my gosh my growth hormone must be so low but the moment wow. I start putting that growth hormone back in my strength comes back my muscular strength so you almost have like that weakness in your muscles well, okay so ways we can put the human growth hormone back into our lives well I have my over-the-counter supplements my active HGH and I produced that because I was surprised how many uh, vitamin companies didn't have that. I'm like, mm. it's just amino acids. So I put all of the amino acids that are precursors. It's 100% cacao with 21 amino acids in an all vegan supplement. And so you don't need a prescription wow. for You don't need a prescription for uh, that, okay. but it will naturally convert into growth hormone. And then my Amino Pro, same thing. It's like my active HGH, but in capsule form. So it promotes healing really, really fast. A lot mm -hmm. of people that go through surgery right after, you know, having, you know, liposuction or something, they're like, how do I get these scars to go? I was like, get on my amino acids, get on my active HGH. Or for $100, test to see where your growth hormone is. And if it's super, super low, then we can go to injections. And the injections are prepped like that. It comes with the water mm -hmm. and then a powder and then little insulin syringes. So right in, and right below the belly button, they'll do these nightly injections. They sleep like rocks. Wow. And then the wrinkles start disappearing. Wow. The collagen oh, wow. comes back. But that's nice to know you can get a going. test. Because right. some of those symptoms yeah. could right. be other things, right? So you should get a, the test to see it's if you need it. It's always great to test. You can never go wrong when testing. And some people are so, you know, they're just so deficient and they just feel like slugs, you know, and no one wants to feel Right, yeah, I mean, you know, this sluggish. This is amazing when you say that because you know you just never know that human growth hormone is something we already have. I already have, and yeah. I was so deficient in it when I started putting it, you know, injecting it every single day. My husband's like, "I think I'm shrinking, honey. I think I'm shrinking." And then he measured me. He's like, "Oh my gosh!" He's like, "You're growing." <laughs> I actually grew two inches when I put myself on the growth wow, hormone, so it made I? me think of. I'm from a third world country. I was so malnourished. You probably didn't. Right, have I didn't have enough growing up, so I grew two inches. I was always four foot eleven. I'm like five foot one and a quarter. <laughs> Oh, human growth hormones, something our bodies produce and need. You, of course, find Dr. Jenny at Age Vital Pharmacy on Main Street in downtown Sarasota, or you can check out their website, agevital.com. Coming up next, we're going to pick the perfect picnic produce. <laughs> Say that three times fast. <laughs> perfect.